brief the RTI report, RTI report for news by the deputy commissioner recording uh, the uh, information sought for uh, number one the list of the uh, of the political party uh, allotted uh, land to them number number two list of new applicant for lands uh, requirement. Number one, name of list holder, purchaser, location and area of the land. Number one, uh, HHPDP, plot number 61, located like Mukhra Ward at area of 3,000 3, 3, square feet. Number two, BGP, plot number nine, located at Bibar Road, Shalong at the area of 3,000 square feet. Number three, uh, Mikhaila Pradesh Congress, plot number 22, located at European Ward, Bishop Cotton. Road at the area of 10,000 square feet. Number five, NPP office uh, located at the opposite BSNL Squatar, European Ward, along at the area of 10 squares, 10,000 square feet. And number six, UDP part 63, located at Alain Mukra Ward, along area 10,000 square feet. And the new applicant for land request. Uh, including number one, land, land for Office of Commissioner in Profession and Disability. Number two, land for Mekhalaya College Teacher Association. Number three, land for uh, Community Hall of the Dorbashnong, uh, Lashmir. Number four, land for construction of uh, Subdiary Ministry of Home Affairs. Number five, land for building, uh, building land for office building to the, to the political party PD. F. And regarding with point number, uh, point number five, that uh, uh, total area of government, government land in East Kasi is uh, estimated around 389 hectares. That means 1,000 hectares more or less. And the RTI is number two, regarding the burning permission submitted by the NPP. Uh, political party to the office of Mekhalaya Development Authority. With regard to this uh, information required for number one, with reference to the notification 1993-2021 of Mekhalaya Building Bylaw Section A3, procedure for building permission in this indication, I request you to provide photocopy of application, structural drawing and building plan submitted by the Official of National People Party for building permission to erect office building at Biba Road near Chief Justice Eastern Building. And number two, as per the schedules, Section A4 of the Mekhalaya Building Bylaw dated 9 3 2021, which clearly mentioned about the information about the information accompanying application for building permission, like the document ex evident, plot of ownership, site plan, building plan general specification and seismic certificate in discretion i request you to provide photocopy or all the related document required for and number two we refer to the schedules section one section 4.17 clearly mentioned that applicant are requested to submit a test copy pata to the authority of urban affair in discretion i request you to provide photocopy of pata like at least deed to the on the side with regard to this, uh, 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 my application, as per my as per the report furnished by the by the office of the uh, Muda on 9 September uh, 2022, clearly mentioned here that that I want to remind you regarding the this lease agreement between the NPP and the DC office. As you know that core in Shillong, land in Shillong belong to the uh, it's not the government land as per the, as per the document uh, in the DC space because the land in Shillong is belong to the non cloud land leased to the Queen's uh, Victoria in 19th, in 10th December 19, uh, 1863. As per the lease, the agreement ended on 19, 1962. But after that, there is a payment of, uh, of 
payment of rent are at the estimate of 50 per annum to the clan. To the clan mean to the no cloud clan. As per the payment, there is payment, the, the last payment to the non cloud at, the, at rupees 50 is 1976, 70, 77. This, this document proves that the revenue land on Shillong belong to the non cloud clan. With refer to the this uh, to this uh, lease agreement with non cloud clan, the DC office, who is the custodian of the revenue on Shillong, clearly mentioned that even the DC of the DC also has no right to uh, handed over land to any to any to any applicant without lease agreement. According to the lease agreement, there there is mentioned here in in section in in section twelve that the lease the lease shall not construct building or the structure or after any structure any building erected on the said land without the permission of the DC. This is the important point. That the lease is, the lease cannot, ne, shall not construct any building without the permission of the DC. This is the lease agreement with the DC and the NPP office. And the point number two, the lease shall not cut down any trees at, the, at that location without the permission of the DC. That is the important document before submitted uh, uh, an extra document to the MUDA of, uh, before getting permission for construct the eh? NPPPs. But after the RTI years, I caught that there is no document from the DC office. That means document number NOC to cut the trees, NOC to construct the building. As per the RTI report, there is no document, uh, there is no document uh, NOC issued by the deputy commissioner regarding the cutting of trees and construct a building. That means this body long weight of this RTI reflect that this NPV office out there constructing the office without the permission as per our RTI report. I can prove you with this with this is with this report also. Here I here I request the office zero copy of permission. But there is no zero copy. I have received no zero copy regarding the permission. This is evidence number one. And this is the evidence number two that there is no energy from the DC office for cutting trees, for construct the building, for getting, getting permission from the MUDA. According to this uh, lease agreement, here is clearly mentioned that the lease, the lease, the purpose of office. People party, the lease is 30 years with effect from 28 August 2020 at the cost of 115 rupees per annum. Per annum. At the cost of 115 rupees per annum, the rent need to be submitted or need to be paid to the DC office. I think this is the document I have, and uh, the RTI I have got from the MUDA, and I think this is the only report that I have got today. And the next step is I will find the another RTI to the DC office regarding the NOC, because as per the as per the RTI uh, furnished by the Meghalaya Urban Development Authority on 21st July 2022, clearly mentioned that deed of issue permission. 22nd December. 22nd December. I doubt that it's 22nd December because, because I request another document to, to submit or to, to, to a supply to me that the zero copy of permission, there is no zero copy of permission in this RTI. Regarding this uh, permission, uh, 22nd December, I will find another RTI to the DC office that, that did you issue any NOC? for cutting trees or, or construct the building as per the lease agreement between the NPP office and the deputy commissioner. With this few words, I end my speech today. Thank you.